So we've made a ton of different recipes here on Spain on a Fork. Many of them have been very good and others have been truly delicious. The one we are making today is exactly that. We're talking stuffed tomatoes with Spanish tuna salad. These stuffed tomatoes have the most beautiful flavor to them and they are so easy to put together. But the best part is that you can serve these on a hot summer's day, yet they're bold enough to enjoy all year round, folks. This is one of those recipes where less is more and simplicity meets extraordinary. Let's begin by hard boiling some eggs. I'm going to add in a couple eggs into a saucepan. Filling it with some cold water, you want to go to about half an inch above the eggs, which is one and a quarter centimeters. And we'll heat it with a high heat. Once the water comes to a boil, I'm going to place a lid on the pan and turn off the heat and let the eggs sit here for exactly 12 minutes to end up with perfectly hard boiled eggs. In the meantime, let's start preparing our tomatoes. I've got four fresh tomatoes here. I'm going to slice a little bit off the top. And using a paring knife, gently run it through the inside of the tomato to loosen up the pulp. And using a spoon, I'm going to gently remove the pulp from the tomato and you want to make sure to be gentle here, otherwise you can easily break that tomato part and I like to have a plate underneath that we can catch the pulp and all the juices, which we're not going to be using in this recipe, but I always like to reserve it, that way I can make extra tomato sauce to use in future recipes. Then we'll season the tomato with a little bit of sea salt and place it over some paper towels cut side down. And continue to do this until all four of your tomatoes are done. And as you can see, I'm placing them over some paper towels with a little bit of sea salt. This is going to help extract some of the water out of the tomatoes, which at the end is going to give them a beautiful firm texture. Once all the tomatoes are done, let's start making our tuna salad. I'm going to be using some tin Spanish tuna and extra virgin olive oil, but you can use whatever tin tuna you like. I'm going to be using four for this recipe. I'm going to add them into a sieve with a bowl underneath. And we'll mix the tuna around in the sieve just for a couple seconds to remove any of the excess olive oil, but you don't want to overmix it, otherwise it's going to dry up. And just like the pulp from the tomato, you don't want to toss away that extra olive oil that's left over from the tin tuna. You can save this, drizzle it over some toasted pieces of bread with some tomato, or even pour it over a salad for a beautiful dressing. And we'll transfer the tuna into a large bowl. For the next ingredient, I'm going to add in a generous half cup of mayonnaise into the tuna, which is 125 grams. We'll finely dice half of an onion, and add in a quarter cup of the diced onions into the bowl, which is about 14 grams. Then we'll finely grate one large clove of garlic. If you don't have a grater, you can just finely mince the garlic and add it into the bowl. Then we'll grab some Spanish pimento stuffed green olives. I'm going to use about 10 for this recipe. Cut each one in half. And then finely chop the olives. I always like to cut them in half before I finely chop them. That way they don't roll all over the board. And we'll add in the chopped olives into the bowl with the rest of the ingredients. And for the final ingredient, we'll roughly chop our hard boiled eggs. Then we'll add in the chopped hard boiled eggs into the bowl with the rest of the ingredients and season everything with sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. And we'll give this a gentle mix, that way all the ingredients are evenly mixed together. And for the final step, let's start assembling our dish. As you can see, by leaving those tomatoes cut side down with the salt over paper towels, we extracted a bunch of water out of the tomato, which at the end gives it the most incredible texture. Let's start stuffing the tomatoes with the tuna salad. And you want to make sure as you're adding it in there that you're compacting it inside the tomato. That way you can add as much of the tuna salad as possible. Then we'll transfer our stuffed tomatoes into a serving dish. Top each one off with a green olive. 
and we'll sprinkle them with some finely chopped chives, our stuffed tomatoes with Spanish tuna salad are done. Such a beautiful presentation and so easy to put together. You can add these into the fridge, that way you can serve them chilled, they'll hold for up to three days, or you can just serve them immediately. Either way, let's give them a try and see how they turned out. All right, folks, here we go. It is absolutely delicious. Such an incredible texture in that tomato by removing some of the water in it. And then tuna salad, so simple, but so good. You saw this very simple ingredients. Comes together in about 30 minutes. Try it at home. You are not gonna believe how good it is. And like I told you at the beginning, this is one of those dishes where simplicity meets extraordinary. Really quick before I go, a shout out to a couple of my newest patrons, Manuel J. Rosales and Edward J. Harrison. Again, guys, thank you so much for becoming patrons of Spain on a Fork. You know how much I appreciate you. For the rest of you, if you're not with me on Patreon, consider becoming one as it really helps with ingredients and equipment to continue making videos like this. You'll find my Patreon link in the description box below and iCard above. If you enjoyed today's video, hit that like button. Leave me a comment below and if you're not subscribed, you know what to do. Smash that subscribe button. Till the next time, hasta luego.